Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to use one key cache on Expedia. This is a very simple thing to do guys, so make sure that you watch this quick and easy video till the very end and follow my steps correctly so you can make sure that this works the same for you and that you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. So guys, the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up the official Expedia.com website right here if you haven't already. And after opening up the website, guys, you want to go ahead and log into your account. So here in the upper right corner, is going to be a sign in button if you have already not logged in. And if you do not have an account, just go ahead and create a new one. And after logging in, you'll be greeted by this main page right here, which is the home page of Expedia that's going to look like this, where you can see you can discover new places and so on. So guys, let's go and see how do you use one key cash, guys, how do you use the money right Right here in Expedia to start booking rooms. As you can see right here guys, one key rewards on any way you travel. So as you can see, you can go ahead and get one key cash just by making reservations using Expedia. So as you can see, go explore here, we can go ahead and see all the benefits and so on. So let's go ahead and find a place that we want to use. Let's say we want to stay right here in this hotel. It's going to open it up and now we can go ahead and book our room after it loads up. So as you can see, here is how it looks. And guys, as you can see, every hotel is going to show you how much you earn in one key cash when reserving. Here you get $3.47, here free, and here you get $11.53. So guys, if you stay in this hotel right here, you're going to go ahead and get $11.53 after your reservation. After you're finished with your reservation, you're going to go ahead and get added this one key cash into your account. And the next time you go ahead and reserve a hotel, it's going to look like this. You'll be able to go ahead and proceed to the payment page. And at the payment page, once you're making your reservation, you'll be able to use that one key cash is going to give you the option to go ahead and selected and how much you want to spend but yeah guys basically that is a hard to do it so i hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel see you guys thanks for watching take care and bye